Hi guys, my name is Mohammad Shahzad and today we are going to install SQL Management Studio 2019 for our SQL 2019 which we have installed in my last video and the guys who didn't saw how to uh, install uh, my SQL 2019 uh, they can go back to my previous video in the list and can see how we can install and then come here to install the management studio because management studio is a platform to give us uh, ability to configure and um, monitor create the databases users for sql uh, all in one place so let's go we will install management studio today i have already downloaded uh, microsoft uh, sql management studio you can download from microsoft website and uh, let's go so I have a one my a this server the old server which we have all installed already our uh, SQL server if you see we have installed here our uh, SQL server 2019 so today we are going to install the uh, management studio so let's go I have already copied uh, downloaded and copy my image here is a SSMS setup in English so um, you can guys also install this one and uh, let's start uh, the installation so i will uh, double click and uh, install this one uh, to start the setup So this one will run and sometimes you know uh, it's better to always uh, start with the if I click here better to start also with the right click and run as admin. So it will give a privileges if there is uh, some issues with your uh, account which you have logged in to the windows. So better to run like that application always right click and uh, run as admin. So I will start run. So it will take a little time and then it will start uh, installation wizard. Okay, here we go. This is the default location and we'll say install. And it will take a little time. I will close my background uh, window so so it, right now it's loading the packages you know yesterday I downloaded from uh, Microsoft uh, website so you can see the release is 18.5 so this one so okay it will install some C++ uh, redistributable files and some other features so meanwhile, uh, I'll do stop my recording and uh, when this progress is completed and uh, I will come back to join you guys. Okay guys, our uh, Microsoft SQL uh, Server Management Studio is uh, completed, So, it, but it's required a restart. So let's go and restart the server. Okay, so it's taking a little bit time to restart. After it's came back, come back, I will open a management studio which we have just installed. Okay, here we go.
Domain Login. Okay, here is our uh, Windows Server 2019, and if we go here, so in our start menu, we can see the management studio here. So SQL Server Management Studio 18, 18. The latest one, which is released by the Microsoft, and let's connect our SQL Server engine here. Because it's first time uh, loading the SQL server. Meanwhile, we can check our C drive space. It's enough. <clears throat> first time load will be a little uh, longer than the after normal use. Okay, here we go, and it's asking for to connect uh, server, and it's automatically picked the engine. So this is the server name. And remember, in our last uh, video, when we were installing SQL Server 2019, we saw there was a two type of authentication: so mix mode and uh, Windows mode. Let's start with the Windows because I, this administrator was added that time during the installation. I'll connect. Here we go, and it's connected to our SQL uh, engine. You can see the databases, system databases, and other things. So let's, I will, uh, I'll disconnect, and I will connect again with the SQL authentication. So SA, and this is the, I will connect, just see, this is, so by default, it's an, uh, uh, during the installation, SA is enabled. So here is the all the other things we can explore with the engine and we can create uh, logins here. We can add other users or we can create a database is here. System database is there. You can create other database. So this is the uh, related to our management studio. So hopefully you guys like it and uh, if you like kindly press the like button for this video and do not forget to subscribe my channel because the next video I'm going to bring it like always on high availability in SQL Server. So and hit the bell icon so you could you should be notified for that. Thank you very much. Take care. Stay home. Stay safe.